How should I start the video? <laughs> Welcome back, guys. Back at you with another video. And we're back. This is there. Back at it again with them white socks. Be oh, fuck. All right, now, what's up, guys? So, let me tell you about the story about my phone. So, I don't know if you've seen, but on my Instagram story, I posted that I had broke my phone. So, this is what happened. Look. So, we get off at 6, because I told you we worked together at the car wash place. And <clears throat> the gym closed at 7, right? So, I was already in a big-ass rush to hurry up and change my clothes at the job. And then, so, I had ran out to the car. It was like 6.10, so I was already running late. So, I had went out to the car to go get my spare clothes for the gym, right? And then I, I like got them, and I guess I put my phone on top of the roof of my car, because I was like in a rush and I didn't realize it. And then I ran back inside, I changed, and then I, I went back in the car, I was like, all right, let's go. So I started driving off, and I was like, okay, where the hell's my phone at? So I, I kept driving, I was like, okay, maybe I should go back to look for it, because was, it wasn't in my seat or like anything like that. And then I got back at Bill's, the place we work at, whatever, and then I had realized that it wasn't anywhere in my, I was looking for like 20 minutes. I was looking at my car for like 20 minutes. And then I had went inside. You I was like, the whole f building in half. Yeah, I was, this yeah, I was, I was searching for that bitch for like 30, 40 minutes. I was like, okay, there's no other like place to look than to go retrace my steps. So I get back in my car and I go, uh, I, I start to leave the place or whatever. And then I look in the middle of the road as I'm about to turn into the main road. I look in the middle of the road and I see phone there just sitting there I'm like fuck but the crazy thing is it's been like 30 40 minutes and then I had I, I was looking at it and it was perfectly fine so I was like oh thank god but then I get out, I get out the car and as soon as I'm like trying to like stop traffic to go like and grab it fucking car merges lanes and booms I just see it go flying <laughs> I heard it like crack I was like damn bro and then finally I had stopped traffic and I went out to go get it and it was I, I don't think I have it with me but it was completely and shattered i was like damn i was like damn i'm not gonna have a phone for like a week i'm gonna lose all my followers i was like bro i was so hey. mad bro but now i got the i think this is the 12 pro max yeah 12 max pro it's basically the same thing as the iphone 11 like i see really no difference i mean the quality is a little bit better and then the camera's all right and then obviously yeah obviously it's bigger but that's really no difference but i just needed a phone asap because i remember i was talking to my mom and she was like Oh, you might not have a phone until next week. I was like, uh, nigga, what? <laughs> nigga, what? So. <laughs> but not today. Um, I think I'm just going to go through a regular leg workout again. I might try maxing out on squats. But I'm kind of like, I'm kind of hectic about it. Just because it's the morning and I haven't like ate that much. I don't have that much like energy in me and carbs in me. So I might eat like a bunch right now, wait for it to digest, and then I might try, or I might try a rep PR of 405, like for eight or 10, because last time I got like five or six, but I hit that for a top set of a three by three the other day, so. But I might do the rep PR, and then I have, let's see if it'll focus, I have a Ronnie Coleman leg workout that I was gonna try, so I might just do the 405 PR, then on top of that, do his workout. Oh my God, I'm not even gonna be able to fucking walk after this. All right, so before the workout, obviously you gotta have fast absorbing carbs. I always tell you guys to eat the Rice Krispie Treats before the workout because it gets in the bloodstream quick. But for the pre-workout, I, I really don't know which one to take. Like the Cloud PR and the Woke is like equally really good. So, and I'm going for a PR, so I might just have to like do a scoop each. <laughs> so I don't know. But the thing is like, I like taking the, the pre-workout on my leg days, but it makes me shit so much. And what I'm thinking is, we're gonna go to the new crunch, because the crunch I go to is like five minutes down the road from my house. I wanna go to the newer one, which is in Vieira, which is like... Vieira. <laughs> which, is, which is like, what, like 20, 30 minutes away from minutes. here. So it's not, it's not too far, but like, it's just like a new gym vibe, so it'll like help me work out better, but... Yeah, I don't, I don't know which one to take, but... Speaking of pre-workout, club PR code MILES at checkout gets you 30% off. That's right, 30. <laughs> hey man, you take this, you'll be woke as fuck. And now I'm black. Let me turn my music down. Alright, anyway, so if you guys don't know who Ronnie Coleman is, it's the fucking, like, 300 pound, big ass... 
But no, nah, he's the like 300 pound. I think he won eight Mr. Olympia titles and like 30 IFBB Pro titles. And he's like big. Uh, he's a big ass. Let's put it like that. He's a big ass. But if you go back and like watch him like working out like back in the day, like in his prime, it's like scary as shit. He always went super, super heavy. And he was just a psychotic ass nigga when it went to working out. Yeah, hey, slogan. What does the IFWB stand for? It's IFBB. Oh, I thought it was I fuck with boobs. <laughs> I'm putting crickets over that. But no, like I'm actually scared to do his workout. Like he always went so heavy, bro. And like, I know I'm going to be like crying. Shut up! I know I'm gonna be like crying during his workout, so I guess we'll just see how this goes later. Who the fuck do you think you're talking to, bud? Uh, huh? Who the fuck do you think you're talking to? <laughs> the fuck, Jit? This is how I lick my women. Y'all ladies get at me. I been had that game on me, nigga. What the fuck oh, you talking about? Brother! <laughs> well, I'm about to be shitting my brains out. <laughs> Get Make sure we got the gym essentials. Okay. All right, make sure we got the squat shoes and the knee sleeves and the... Oh, don't mind my extra large bag of croutons. <laughs> uh, and we got the uh, squat shoes, the knee sleeves. I might use this for the PR because I'm gonna have to go crazy today. But I think that's all we need. And then we're gonna start heading out, put the Rice Krispies in here, <laughs> and it will be game time. All right. Hey ladies, you see this fat water cash, you hear me? You hear me? You hear me? Real West Side shit, real West Melbourne shit, nigga. Bands are make her dance, no kizzy, no cap, nigga. Get at me, we at the strip club tonight. Bands are make her dance. Get at me, lady. Get at me, lady. Twisted Rooster tonight. Tonight, nigga. Tonight, nigga. Can you help me pick this up? Alright. It's my mom's money. I just had to use it for the video. Yeah, I that. Yeah. But don't forget this one. She'll oh, be pissed. Yeah. <laughs> Can't let her find out. Yeah. All right. All right. <laughs> oh, fuck. What a beautiful morning. Chirpy. Hey, ladies, ladies, look. I know my back seat's dirty, but look. <laughs> look at me. One time. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? One what? time, you know. What, what the fuck? Y'all know. <laughs> no, we don't know. You don't know. I put the seats up. I clear out the back seat. You see where I'm going with it? No. Oh. Oh, what are you talking about? You think you want to me, huh? Sex. Oh. Or, or, or right, get, we'll, we'll be back soon. Demo. Okay. Or, you know what I'm saying? I get two ladies, you know, we can do the little scissor, scissor action. You feel me? This is metal or metal? Like, like scissors? Oh my god. Are they safety scissors? Because I can't be around normal ones. <laughs> I think this is a joke, huh? Miles, we're going to have to talk about this. Um. I, I can't be around children, okay? Miles. Wow. What? I, I can't be around children. I know, you're a pedophile. I know, I know. Right. Registered in the state of Florida. You're gonna, you're gonna cut this out, right? <laughs> All right, so, damn, why is my air so loud, nigga? All right, so right now, uh, in Surprise, the car. What? Oh my God! Oh my God! That just scared the shit out of me. Oh my White people are weird. All right, but not anyway, so we're going to head over to the gym right now. It'll probably be like a 20, 30-minute ride, but um, already pre-workout kicking in, so I got to hurry up and make it there before it starts to wear off or I shit myself in here because of all the caffeine I took, but I will meet you guys there, and um, and his name is John C. Uh, yeah. Come and suck on my jewel dick. My daughter almost got out of me. My bitch going clean and spit. Yeah. On my mama, I need a blockage. When are y'all niggas gonna stop sleeping on Detroit? Detroit is on top in this music shit. I'm spitting everywhere, my nigga. Listen. 
Touch the channel stay 44 dwell around. Break it hard for the crowd, boy, it's what it wrong. Break it down the house, the rest I left from home. Take it out of more codeine and styrofoam. I keep a couple of lean on, you don't wanna die alone. What the fuck is one fight? I wanna buy a move! I got the plug that's in the bricks, I'm trying to find a boat. Tired of buying true air cars, I'm finna buy a goat. Shit, little bitch be chasing me for years, she got strong ankles. Woo! Alright, so we just made it. Uh, it was only like a 20, 20 yeah, minute. 20 minute. Yeah, 20 minute ride. But as you can see, like it looks way bigger than the Crunch Ico. Hold up, it's like really bright. Hold up, well, like you can see the building ends like yeah, right back there. Yeah. It's not very deep. I mean, don't get me wrong. Like all crunches are like huge ass gyms, but with this one, like all the mach you'll see inside, all the machines are like bunched together, and it's it's like. Ugh. I mean, it's a big building, but yeah, still, y'all yeah. get what I'm saying. Compared to the other one. Yeah, yeah. But yeah, anyways. Um, we're gonna go in, hopefully he can get in with my guest pass. If not, we can just do like a little day pass type shit for him. But I'm gonna meet you guys in the gym. I'm gonna get ready to uh, do this Ronnie Coleman workout. Who I'm about to be. I don't even know if I'm gonna be able to drive home after this shit. All right, so we just made it in here for legs. Um, I need to put you through a workout one day. You need, you need to try some. I swear to God, we, we work out sometimes like as a big ass group and this nigga hit 315 deadlift, like easy as shit, like he was like, like boom am i doing it right dude right it was like fast as shit so that one day but we just landed here um i'm about to warm up for my squats do my little dynamic warm-up routine if you haven't seen it yet i posted on my instagram so go check that out if you haven't but i'm about to get warmed up and then i'm gonna try the 405 pr and then from there i'm gonna i'm gonna put up the ronnie coleman workout we're gonna go from there it's gonna be a tough one Between this 20 reps, right look at them legs. The difference between look this them. right here and these right here is <laughs> time, bro. That no, no, bro. 20 reps, Hell. easy. <laughs>
All right, so doing a three by three right now, just start off the squats. Last week I did 405 as a three by three on my top set for five. So I'm either try that again or go higher. I want to get six or seven. But like I said, it's still kind of early in the morning and I haven't ate that much today, so I don't got that much energy in me. So we're gonna try it out. That shit. He didn't get on camera, but I'm passed out. I had to walk away for like five minutes after that heavy ass squat. But now I'm gonna follow the rest of the workout. I think next we got leg press, so let's see how that goes. It's called Bio Hair Fitness in the Item Shop. <laughs> All right, so as you guys know, Ronnie was known for going heavy as shit, even though he did high reps. So that's what I'm gonna do here. I got six plates on leg press right now. I know it's not too much, but we're gonna make it work. I'm gonna try 12 reps with this one. I think this is my third set, so I'm gonna give it all I got. Hopefully I throw up, I hate that shit. Set, but I think the hardest I've ever done on leg press is a triple drop set starting from six plates. That shit killed me. I couldn't even walk after that. But now we're gonna unrack all these plates, bro. Unrack and weight is harder than the actual workout. <laughs> like, oh god, all these plates. But next, I don't know if you guys can see. I'll put it up. But next, we got walking lunges. About two sets of 100 yards. So we'll probably just go from here and back, or we'll just probably go over there. But I think I might do weighted. I don't know, because I got a lot of blood in my legs right now. A lot of lactic acid built up, so I'll see you guys over there. All right, so real quick from the, on the, back when I was doing the leg press, bro, if you're doing leg press, don't ever hyper extend your knees. So like, when you're pressing, don't ever put them in, in straight out or lock them out. I'll tell you right now, if you're going heavy or you're close to failure, and you hyper extend your knees, you're not going to legs. Look it up, look it up on YouTube. You'll find a video. Yeah, yeah, you're not going to have no legs after that. Find like, a video on what the fuck you, happens. Yeah, I'll put it in the video real quick to see. Nah, you can't. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you <gosh>. can't. <laughs> Shit break in half, but now we're on to just some walking lunges. Thank God these are a little bit, even though we're keeping the intensity high, these are a lot easier than leg press and heavy ass squats, so we're gonna get this out of the way real quick. <laughs> All 
All right, so next on the list, we have leg extent. Oh shit, we have leg extensions, but someone's on it right now. So what we're gonna do is next would be standing standing leg curls, but they also don't have that machine here. So what we're gonna do is just the line leg curls instead, and then that'll be four sets of 15 to 10 reps. Still keeping it heavy, but high reps. But this workout is killing me, bro. All right, so now we're on to the line leg curls, like I said. So if you if you're like me and you have over dominant quads. Try splitting your two leg days throughout the week. It's a hamstring and quad focus because when I used to do my two leg days, I would do like mainly like all quads and like one hamstring thing. But now I have that balance and it's brought my hamstrings up a lot. When you lack having strength in one of your body parts, for example, with the legs, if your quads are over dominant and your hamstrings are weak, it can force your quads to work harder than they do. And then you can get injured because of that. And also we're doing single leg, like I said in the last video, for unilateral purposes. What? <laughs> but no, we're doing unilateral to also help muscle imbalances. For example, a popular one is usually the lats. Like I said in the last video, when people usually do lat spreads, or they'll even say like, oh, I failed to feel it in this arm, or this lat, or this lat. So try doing single arm. That's what I mean by unilateral, single. Like single leg, single arm. So try doing that instead, it'll help bring it up. This this workout is killing me, dude, like for real. I'm just glad he ain't do, he ain't have Bulgarian split squats or RDLs in this bitch, because I'd be dying right now. second to last thing, leg extensions. When you're doing these, because I used to do this too, don't rush through it, especially at the top of the movement, you're gonna lose a lot of tension. So like lower the weight a lot, because the weight I'm using right now is only 85. I can fuck around and do the whole rack right now, but I'm not gonna do that because there's no tension on the quads, especially since this is a bodybuilding style workout. Ronnie Coleman, even though he did go heavy and use a lot of momentum, <laughs> even though he used a lot of momentum, try doing that. Lower the weight a lot more and just squeeze at the top. It, I promise you it's 10 times harder. You might get a odd cramp, so don't blame me, but <laughs> you're gonna see. All right, so someone's using the, see the leg curl, so we're doing heavy ass RDLs right now just to end off the workout. I kind of wanted to do these anyways, but they weren't in the workout, so I was like, fuck, but I did, last time, I did 110s for eight, but I was with a belt, and now I'm, I'm gonna try 115s for 10. So, I need wraps, bro. The first thing that gives out my grip strength, bro, like, I swear to God, but I'm gonna end it off strong right here, so hopefully I can push through with 10 reps. Let's do this. zoomed in because it looked really close so I tried to zoom out and then it zoomed in right on your fucking ass. Oh my god. Yeah, yeah get into it. Get into it. Get into it. Yeah. 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 Oh shit. <laughs> Stupid.
was a hard ass workout. <laughs> oh my goodness, that was that was hard. And that, that goes to show like I post like different like workouts every other day. There's a certain point to where like if you're doing like too much like extra shit, then you shouldn't even be doing it. Like you saw the workout, all we did was the basic compounds. We did we did squats, leg press, see the leg curl, like those are the basic movements, and those movements are gonna be the ones that will bring you the most progress, especially over time using like progressive overload or if you're actually like on a program type shit, that's just gonna bring you the real results over time and not doing like stupid shit and extra shit. But right now, I probably should have fresh when I, <laughs> when I left because I'm so sore right now. But now we're probably gonna hit up Zaxby's down the street. And I then, never been there, bro. He, yeah, he hasn't been there. I don't know if you guys have a Zaxby's where you guys live, but bro, best fast food world canes might be better but that's that's up north huh yeah yeah that's that's a whole different story that's <laughs> 10 times better than zaxby's but we're gonna hit up zaxby's right now and we'll meet you guys there Yeah, I, I really go bother style, you feel me? I go in there pay all one right now, nigga, you feel me? I ain't even gonna stunt on it like that, nigga. <laughs> oh my gosh, bro. What you mean? Oh my god. Okay, now here's the real taste test. <laughs> <laughs> no, what the? Oh, what the hell This man spitting fucking. <laughs> this man fucking spitting everywhere, fucking spitting cheese curd balls at people. Fucking disgusting. Close your mouth. <laughs> Alright, turn the fucking music off. Alright. Oh god, he's spitting facts, nigga. Y'all niggas need to listen up. But that's gonna end it for today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed that intense workout. And I guess you could say it was a little bit of a mini vlog because we were talking and shit. But don't forget to like and subscribe. If you're not subscribed, are you doing are watching this video go subscribe right now we're ending it right here next video is going to be the wing challenge for tonight that's going to be crazy so if you want to see more videos we're taking over youtube like it we're taking over youtube like it we're taking over youtube so like and subscribe right now Then they go realize it's serious. I ain't even on that period. I'm making millions, I'm serious. That money come in very